I uh, decided to venture outside and try to fix my flag. Um, it's leaning over, the pole busted in the windstorm. And I was sitting here at the table and watching the birds and I keep looking at this flag and it's warmed up a little bit so I decided to come out and try to uh, take it down and fix that pole. Let me show you what it looks like. Okay, it's pretty bright out here. I don't know if you're gonna be able to see the pole is bent over, but I'm gonna take it down and straighten up that pole. So first thing I need to do is go over here to the car and hopefully the trunk will pop open and I can get some tools. Uh, let's see if I got my keys here. Um, Okay, it looks like it popped open. That's a good thing. I guess I should probably start my car. I haven't started it. I don't think I started it yesterday. But uh, got my tools in here, so let me get some tools and we'll start on that flagpole. All right, it is really hard to see out here. There, maybe you can see that, how the pole is bent in half. I just have this up here with <clears throat> bungee, or not bungee cords, but uh, zip ties. I have the three zip ties here holding it up, but I'm going to take those down and then fix that bent pole there. And I did get a couple few, few tools out of the car. And it's really, really, really bright out here. So uh, I can't really see what's filming and what's not. I guess I need some sunglasses. I'm not even sure where they are. But let me go ahead and uh, set this down and I'll go undo those zip ties, take that down and find some more poles and fix the flag. Hopefully y'all can see there. Hopefully y'all can see that. He got bent in half here. So I'm going to have to uh, take all these off. These little things here. And see if we can find a different pole. So I'm going to pause you all while I go look for a different flagpole, which I do have one somewhere. I just got to find it. I get that apart. There we go. All right. I got the flag back on a straight pole. So now I'm going to put it in this big long one here. And then I'm going to... Uh, I don't have any big black zip ties, so I'm going to take these yellow ones and I'll put two together and I'll use about six of them to put the flag back up there. Alright, so I'm taking two of these little yellow ones and I'm going to put them in here. Oops. Make sure you get it the right way. There we go. Hopefully y'all can see what I'm doing here. There. And then I'll put that around the pole like that so that uh, it's big enough. So let me go ahead and go try to put this flagpole back up. And I'll need my pliers. Now we have a 
straight flag. I need to probably put uh, a couple more bungee, uh, I keep calling them bungee cords, zip ties right there in the middle and I'll bring the scissors out later and cut off the extra. So let's go get a couple more zip ties. As you can see, it has warmed up quite a bit. It's 40 degrees today, so it's bearable out here anyway. But uh, yeah, let's get a couple more of these zip ties and put on there because these little yellow ones don't work as good as the black ones. But they're out in the storage shed and I'll have to go find them. I don't see the yellow ones either. I may have taken them over there to the table. Still a little bit chilly, but it's bearable. At least I can be outside for a little while. Yeah, here's the other zip ties. So I'll get two more and put them together. And make sure if you use zip ties and you put them together, make sure you put them in right, because if you don't, they just pull right back out. So you gotta make sure you get them in there so they so they tie. All right, so hopefully that'll do it. And the flag problem is fixed. Let me uh, try to get out of the sun a little bit. It's super, super bright. I'm gonna have to come out here and clean up this dog mess. Having the dogs in the house, and letting them outside, or messing by my door, so got to get that cleaned up. But anyway, um, let me turn that around one more time and show you the flag it is fixed. It looks much better. So, yeah, there we go. And um, I still need to start the car, put my tools away. And I guess that's about it for today. But uh, I just want to check in with y'all and say hey and Hope everybody's surviving the cold. Hopefully it's about over and it'll start warming up again. But anyway, thanks for watching and, and uh, spending a little bit of your day with me. I um, hope you guys have a good rest of the day. And I will catch you on the next one. So till then, God bless, take care, and stay warm. See you later.